I am squinting into the sun, and behind me is a tram. I am currently at Stargate on the southern end of the Blackpool Tramway. So of course, another place, another tram system. You know what that means? Let's visit the Blackpool Tramway. A funny thing with like trams in Blackpool is the fact that everyone knows about the cool like heritage ones you have near the pier, but nobody ever remembers that there's also the, you know, new modern trams that they also have here. They're really underrated. All right, well, we're at the stop now, so we'll wait for a tram to show up. Naturally, when one visits Blackpool, one visits Pleasure Beach. As much as I'd love to go to Pleasure Beach right now, I do not have the time, <laughs> nor the money, as much as I'd love to. But one thing you can do instead is, of course, look at the lovely promenade. And Blackpool Beach. This place is great, honestly. This specific bit, I know Blackpool does often get a little bit of flack, but honestly, at least this place in particular, this part of Blackpool, I really like it here. This is quite nice. Something very noisy is going on in the pier over there. Hmm. You know what? Let's go on the pier. Why not? Look at that view down there. It's so good. Anyway, here's the pier. Piers are fun. Anyway, what was this video about again? Oh yeah, trams. Let's go back to the trams. Okay, tram time. I'll try, please. Okay, Manchester Square. I got off here completely randomly. Uh, there was nothing in particular, but let's take a quick look. There's a large number of little interesting things like this, just sort of scattered all along the coastway here. It's pretty cool. This part of the beach is uh, a lot busier than the other end of the beach down there, but over there is, I believe, Central Pier. I thought it was North Pier at first, but no, it's a Central Pier. North Pier's a bit further up. And you've also got a pretty nice view of Blackpool Tower from here. There's going to be a lot of beach in this video, I can tell already. Okay, back at Manchester Square. So I think I'll go to the uh, North Pier next, probably. And after that, I actually don't know what are the significant things there are here. So we'll continue on anyway, but we'll just, just select stations by random, basically. Huh, I just had uh, one of the old trams go by, one of the heritage ones. That was cool. Uh, whoops. I, uh, I may or may not have kind of zoned out on the tram and accidentally missed North Pier. I'm now at the next stop. I'm at Pleasant Street. <laughs> oh no. Whoopsie daisy. I mean, hey, this is a, uh, an interesting passageway. I guess while I walk there are a couple of things I could talk about. So firstly, uh, the ticket I'm using is an adult all-day ticket that I usually use on these. Only six quid, so not bad. And what do I think of the trams themselves? They're also pretty cool. They feel like a sort of hybrid between the Sheffield trams and the West Midlands Metro trams. Just my opinion. 
I appear to be walking towards the beach yet again. There we are, finally. The North Pier and Blackpool Tower. So there you go, that's uh, all three Blackpool Piers done now, so I don't know. We can continue on, which I'm going to do, but we'll just select some stops randomly, I suppose. Back at the tram stop. So Ankershum, or Anchor's home, I, I, I don't know which pronunciation it is, Ankershum Lane. And yeah, so this is the start of the bit of the tramway that uh, diverts from the uh, actual coastline. Um, and there's also a park here, so that's cool. Cannot beat a park walk, especially near the coast. Pretty nice looking area. You see, the good thing about coming north up here is the fact that, you know, you've still got the nice looking coastline and everything, but you're far away from the busy central Blackpool bit. So this would probably be my choice of place to come if I ever wanted to come here for a beach visit. Well, we're back on the beach again. What a surprise. Oh God. I've been on the beach too much in this video. This is enough beach for one video. There's like three different people paramotoring here as well. Is this some sort of paramotoring hotspot? <laughs> right, anyway, I have been here long enough. I think we're gonna end the trip now. Let's go to Fleetwood Ferry. Wow, uh, who, who could have possibly written this in the sand? Beyond me. It's these things again, that were also outside of Manchester Square. What are these? Back at the tram stop finally, and we can conclude the journey at Fleetwood Ferry. And there we are, Fleetwood Ferry, and that is the whole Blackpool Tramway complete. And this is Ferry Beach. You can see, I think, uh, Haitian Port over there, and I think just over there, I can just about see, I think, Barrow in Furness. Brilliant. All right, well, that's another light rail visited. Blackpool Tramway, done. There's only one left to go now, and that is the Edinburgh Trams. And then this series will be done. Crazy. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you'd like to know whenever I upload any new videos, please do consider hitting that subscribe button. Would mean a lot to me. So I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you at the Edinburgh Trams. Goodbye. And of course, a massive shout out goes out to all of my patrons and channel members who are listed on screen now, and of course, a warm welcome to my new standard premium patron, Antigod. Thank you all for supporting the channel. Love you.